great news. Oh, please wait here a moment, if you would be so kind. Lady Ningwang instructed me to advise her upon your return. My greetings to both of you. Long time no see. No need to be so formal with us, Ningguang. We've known each other for a long time now. You must be super busy with all the preparations for Lantern Rite. Don't mind us. On the contrary, I think it is those that I have known longest to whom I should extend the greatest courtesies. Alas, on a different day, I would invite both of you inside for some tea and a brief respite from your travels. But you're quite right. Trivial matters aside, there's no escaping the fact that we have a grand concert to organize. Once the performance itself is over, we'll then need to invite the representatives of the Iridescence Tour for a discussion on future collaboration opportunities. The financing arrangements alone could well entail many rounds of discussion. Simply put, there will always be work to do. Whoa, you're already thinking that far ahead? <laughs> Well, we can discuss more current affairs if you'd prefer. I trust you saw this year's Ming Shao Lantern at the docks when you arrived at the city? Yeah, it looked like a goose. Which adeptus is it modeled on this time? Seagazer. I believe you're familiar with the name. Legend holds that he was free-spirited and easygoing. People described him as a cheerful soul and a loyal friend. On this marvelous lantern rite, we pray that the fallen heroes may be guided home. If the sound of music can flow like the rivers and streams into every corner of the land, perhaps the souls of those who have gone before us will hear the song of a new era. I wonder whether the melodies will be to their liking. Oh, they're gonna love them! I'm unsure of it! At least, if the guy you mentioned is anything to go by, the Adepti and heroes of the past sound like a positive and free-spirited cheerful bunch. They're sure to be open to new music. <laughs> well, let's hope so. I heard that you'll be going on a search with Ganyu to find the descendants of a fairy lady from a Fontaine legend. I'm sure this quest to uncover the truth behind an ancient story will turn into a most charming tale. Do share it with me, won't you? I couldn't bear to miss out.